like every Range Rover, luxury and refinement is at the heart of the Evoque convertible, as well as unrivaled capability and practicality for a convertible SUV. With its advanced Z-fold mechanism, the fabric roof lowers in just 18 seconds and raises in 21 seconds at driving speeds of up to 30 miles per hour. And whether the roof is open or closed, the impressive luggage capacity remains the same. A ski hatch can also be specified for maximum versatility. The stowed roof doesn't impact on cabin space either. The SUV's four-seat premium interior boasts comfortable levels of rear legroom. Additional load bracings and high-strength steel door sills maintain on- and off-road capability. In the unlikely event of a rollover, strengthened A-pillars and the rollover protection device in the rear quarter creates a large safety space for the occupants. With its comprehensive range of technologies and a crisply defined silhouette that remains faithful to the original design, the new Range Rover Evoque Convertible redefines all-season motoring. The Evoke's been a fantastic success for our brand. And it continues to excite our customers. This is a vehicle that truly resonates on an emotional level. And at the heart of the Evoke is its distinctive and charismatic design. Through a clear design strategy, we have now created a new expression of the Evoque's distinctive character, the new Range Rover Evoque Convertible. The convertible is a natural progression of the Evoque's design, broadening its appeal and character while maintaining the integrity and desirability of the original. This is the first truly capable convertible. It brings another dimension to the Evoque's unique appeal. It's a vehicle that's about being open to the senses, creating enjoyment and experiences. The Evoque in convertible form just got even more desirable. We're here in Granary Square, which has been redeveloped. Behind us, beautiful renovation of Central St. Martins. Central St. Martins has produced some great designers and artists over the years. Evoke Convertible comes from the Evoke, and one of the important things was not to erode the image of the Evoke. It's an incredibly dramatic car, a vehicle that truly resonates on an emotional level. We haven't seen a luxury convertible SUV before, and that's something unique. 
This is a vehicle that's very capable in the winter and incredibly enjoyable in the summer. So we're going to be transforming Granary Square. We're going to film it going from a cold winter's night into a breathtaking summer's day. It's a creative way of presenting a very creative vehicle. Nurturing creativity is very important to us. Land Rover is partnering with the Bourne Summit of Creativity, something we felt was actually a very good fit for us. It's something that sponsors and nurtures and supports creativity in all its manifestations. And I think that is really important for us. It's something that we want to be involved in by recognising the past but harnessing the future that's giving us something from a design perspective that is truly differentiated from what's going on in the rest of the automotive world. Evoke Convertible comes from the Evoke and it's been designed in a way that doesn't erode the image of, of, of the original Evoke. Remember this is a vehicle that's been incredibly successful for us, uh, a vehicle that truly resonates on an emotional level and the Evoke convertible just adds to that. Now it's a convertible but it's not any old convertible. As you'd expect from Land Rover you'd expect a convertible that does something different and is capable and, is, and sits wherever it will be. This is a vehicle that you'll see in, in every major city. One of the important things was not to erode the image of the Evoque. It's an incredibly dramatic car. It's very distinctive falling roof, rising belt line, wheel at each corner, it's got a great stand, stance and as I said it's a vehicle that truly resonates with people on, on an emotional level. That desirability coming for its, from its design. So what we've done is we've maintained that design, you know, we haven't changed the fundamental design, we've changed the areas that we've had to change to create a, com a convertible. What Evoke did for, for Land Rover, remember, is it brought a whole new a group of customers. I mean 80% of the people that bought Evoque had never bought a uh, Land Rover of any description before. 70% never even bought an SUV. And remember we've sold over 450,000 vehicles. So it, it, it will bring more people up to the brand. Certainly I think an, a, um, a younger age profile. People that like the idea of wind in their hair. They want to be open to the senses. They want something that that's glamorous, that's, that's well designed. So Land Rover is partnering with the Bourne Summit of Creativity, something we felt uh, was actually a very good fit for us. Um, it's something that, that, that sponsors and nurtures and supports creativity in, in all its manifestations. Um, and I think that is, that is really important for us. Um, it's something that we want to be involved in. Creativity is our lifeblood and it's going to become more and more important as we grow this brand and make it all even more desirable. I've been into, in the design business for a, for a long time and um, it's given me an incredible amount of, of pleasure. I think the world would be a very sad place without, without art, without design and without, without, cre without creativity. So for us it is very important to support that. We talk about iconic status, I think it's a word, word that's used too liberally. However, we do have vehicles that have that iconic status. Range Rover for one, 45 years of Range Rover. As it's evolved, it's gained that sort of iconic status because there's nothing else like it. The Evoque is another one. I wouldn't necessarily call it a, an icon yet, but I think it has the potential to become one. You know, it's been around for a few years now. People fell in love with it right from the start and they continue uh, to desire it. I mean, great design is, is it's about fundamentals. It's about getting the proportion, the stance right, getting, getting certain elements in the right place. And um, Certainly that's something that's very important to us and the only way you do that of course is to make sure that design and engineering are inextricably linked, they work in harmony together to make sure when you create the layout of the car where the wheels go relative to the overall length, the, the overhangs, the height etc are all very well balanced. We're, we're quite unique at Land Rover in, in that we have a, a unique heritage, a heritage that's evolved over 60 years. And we mentioned some of the iconic vehicles that we do have. Defender is certainly one of them. Range Rover's uh, uh, another. Discovery to a certain extent. And I think Evoke will, will, will get iconic status eventually. We feed off that 
heritage in terms of the DNA. We're not looking back, we're, mar we're respectful of that heritage, but we can't be harnessed by it. But what we do get from the heritage is a DNA that gives us, gives us a certain amount of ingredients that we can cook or present in a, in a different way. And I think it's that DNA that's evolved by recognizing the past but harnessing the future that's giving us something from a design perspective that is truly differentiated from what's going on in the rest of the automotive world. That's my view anyway.